of our town is that you got a four point six. Four point seven now, point, officially. Oh, sorry. Officially, Correct. yeah. Four point seven. Yeah. How in the world do you get a four point seven in high school? I took a lot of AP classes, and I also um do on road at FIU. I took like five classes at FIU. Well, my mom always put me in classes that were high, and I could never as I had to get home do my homework for can't do anything else homework. No games during the school week, so. And then with football, which made me a little, a little more worried about it, but it was an easy adjustment because everybody, my school Evans, you can't fail, like, unless you want to fail. So, because tutoring every day after school and online for us now. So, it was easy. It was easy trans transition. Okay. All right, tell me about the, what made you submit to the eight cents, to eight cents in the draw. Uh, my, uh, what's it called, past future, future second data advisor hit me up and said to apply for it, so I did. And, um, I worked with them before in a financial literacy course, so I knew it was a legit thing and I, I could do it. It would be like a, um, a cool experience. And, uh, it was like it was like a, a week long course, I believe. Um, we got we met a couple of days on Zoom and we talked about financial literacy. I mean, I knew like to save and all that, but they taught me about investment and like how to save properly. Like, I just like save, put money away. Mm -hmm. I'm how to like save, what to spend, what not to spend, and like stuff like that. Uh, what school are you are you going to be attending um, for uh, postgraduate or to continuous education? University of Florida. University of Florida. What are you going to be measuring in? Uh, pre pharmacy. Explain to me uh, why the pharmacy field. Um, well, my dad had diabetes, and like when he went to the hospital for it, type two diabetes, uh, it kind of like triggered me to like figure out how can people, how can I help people with his like condition? Because sometimes like his medicine gets mixed up. And it's like weird, so I'm like, how can I like? I want to be able to help people like that, not get, not get scared or worried. All right, go ahead and open that, and there'll be something on the first two lines. I want you to read that out loud uh, for me. Are the winner enclosed is a check of eight hundred dollars to use towards your next journey as you continue to acquire assets and build wealth. What are your plans now that you got the funds to uh, to invest? Uh, probably I'm in, I'm not invest. I'm giving to my parents for them to put it towards my uh, uh, tuition and room and all that. Uh -huh. Yeah, so that's what this is gonna go to. That's what I'm going to. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, congratulations, sir. Thank you. Much appreciated. Did you have anything to say, boss? I think she wants me to. You can go give her a hug. Yeah, go give her a hug. Yeah, go give her a hug on camera. I'm a little sweaty, man, from outside, man. Hey, congratulations, man. You, you never failed the task and never um, have failed to amaze me by the things that you've done mm -hmm. through the four or five years that I've known you. Um, you've been a leader. Mm -hmm. um, you've been the president of our youth club um, since. Without yeah. even having a title, you were the president. The kids uh, from the middle school, um, they really look up to you. Mm -hmm. If you really, if you don't know it or not, they look up to you. And since I know y'all looked up to you <laughs> as well, it, that's not hard to do. But man, congratulations! Thank you. And if you need anything, you got my number, got my email. I'm here for you. Gainesville ain't but two and a half hours away, yeah. so don't get me a uh, chill to come up there and have to, <laughs> have to put the smack down on you, man. And, um, love you, man. Love you, too. All right, man. Thank you. I want to thank Mr. and Mrs. Reeves for everything, for their com company, and help me with the literacy course, and this scholarship.